All right, so step one, you're gonna wanna get your RAM. Um, these, these, they're, uh, I just downloaded some off the internet, so I think I have six gigs right here. Uh, you're gonna be want, you're gonna want to wear uh, safety glasses and a gas mask, otherwise this won't work. You're gonna need, like, some sort of, of, like, case for the computer. Um, I just got this, like, uh, this, like, wooden half of a rectangle, so, anything that has a sort of flat surface should work. So, you're just gonna wanna, just gonna, like, hammer, uh, be sure you're using screws or else this will not work, so. And, uh, you gotta use a hammer, too. So you're just gonna... Ow. I don't get why this isn't working. I'm doing everything right. Oh, we made it through. All right. Now we gotta hold this here. Make it go into the wood. I think we got it. We just need to make it stay. Oh, come on. So, what? That friend, I think not. Ow. Huh. Alright. So that's the first stick of RAM. I think it's in there pretty good. Yeah, it can spin. Alright, so um, now we got to get another stick of RAM in there. Alright, so we got both sticks of RAM in there, that's great. If you want, you can put a, another uh, screw in to like make it more uh, secure. I'm just gonna do that with one to like show you guys how to do it. Ow. Alright, that didn't work because I hit my thumb and I don't want to do that again. So, um, next up, uh, if you want to make it more compact, then you can just like squish them, so... So now they're like a lot more compact as you can see. You can even turn them. That, that makes it run better. It's not a PC without the keyboard. This isn't a, an actual keyboard. I mean, it has all the buttons you need, but as long as, long as you're not using it for typing, it's, it's fine. Why is this so hard? Alright, so a bit of the, the keyboard from motherboard fell out, but that's fine. You can just slip it back in there. It'll heal eventually. This thing is never going to fall apart. Alright, so now you're going to want to make the um, plug-in for the power supply. Got one right here. Any type of cable is good. Plug it in. If it doesn't stay, that's fine. Yeah, right there. That's that's the that's the power outlet. So if we plug this in, it'll just turn right on. Cable. Um, that trends. That's. Tr All right. So I switched out the micro USB cable for an aux cable. So that's plugged in right there. They're, they're like transmitting the, the display. Uh, the, the PC has a, a built-in mic, so you can literally just, um... Hey, hey PC! You uh, d say, um, 56R. Okay. Hey, PC, say 15. 
Okay. Hey, PC, say uh, 200. Okay. Hey, PC, say coach. Coach. Hey, PC. Oh, sud. Hey, PC, uh, say four. Uh, four. It, isn't that just fantastic? Isn't that one of the best things you've ever seen? Uh, what a what a beautiful oh, the ox cable. Well, it, well yeah, if, if you want to try this, I, I highly recommend it. I mean, it, it works great. Oh, and also... Oh, and also, uh, you're going to want to put some lip sill on the keyboard. It acts just as a uh, thermal paste. It's... Also... If you want a keyboard, like an actual keyboard, not just this thing, um, just get a keyboard and take off all the buttons. So you can just, you can literally just, um, you got a keyboard. It's, it's simple as that. All right, so if you want it to be like more compact, I, I know a lot of people want that. You, you're just gonna wanna hit it with absolutely everything possible. more compact now and you only have say 70% uh, chance of dying when you're using this I mean that's pretty good compared to most other PCs thank you for watching again like and subscribe because it, it, I like it